another beautiful in the very heart of Ibejuleki, Dango Te Refinery area precisely. Today I'll be showing you some of the ongoing construction that is happening in Ibejuleki. Recently, you've also noticed that we've been having the influx of tankers coming to Dangote Refinery, you know, to offload and take for But we have to show you the work that is ongoing. We are constructing the expansion of this road. This is a full concrete road that is being constructed that can take more of the containers. Containers like this, containers like this can plow this road. Why? Because this is what is being put on this thing. So, to every Nigerian who has been asking now, what exactly is the government doing, or what exactly is Dangote Refinery doing to making sure that this road can be plowed by containers? They said, this is what we are doing, and this is the construction. Look further, you will see that the construction is ongoing, both morning, afternoon, and night. And some of the houses that are closer. To the right of way has been demolished itself so the rest are short i will show you more of this ongoing construction process and so go to my channel and i mean you're one and only reactor today i decided to take a trip to ibejileki area of lagos nigeria to see the ongoing full concrete road construction that is happening this road leaks directly to the dangote refinery and the expansion is being done to accommodate tankers and heavy duty trucks as the Dangote refinery commences operation. Also note that there is Lekki Deep Sea Port and Lekki Fitre Zone located in this same location. This road used to be a bottleneck for drivers and businesses alike. But now, look around, what was once a very narrow congested road is now transforming into a multi-lane highway that is not just for the everyday driver but ready to carry heavy duty trucks massive vehicles like tankers and containers that will be carrying goods to and from the dangote refinery and the lekki free train zone this project is indeed a game changer for lagos economy it is a very crucial part of lagos state plan to boost industrial activities and is the transportation for industries around Ibejuleki. And what exactly is the vision? The vision is to ensure that the thousands of trucks and vehicles don't grant Lagos traffic to us, like what we have in Apapa Axis. As we begin this wonderful trip, let's talk about how this road was once before now. The smooth ride that we're about to experience wasn't always the case before now. In fact, not long ago, the journey from Meleka Junction to the Dangote Refinery area was filled with bombs, portals, and a lot of wahala. But thanks to this expansion project, the road is not only wider, but is strategically designed to carry the weight of the refinery's demand. Heavy duty trucks, fully loaded tankers will soon move with ease from Dangote Refinery and the Lekki Deep Sea Port. This expansion is not just for transportation, it is an investment in Nigeria's future. Have you ever wondered why so much is happening in the Bejuleki? The road isn't the only thing getting bigger. This area is home to the largest refinery in Africa, the Lekki Free Trade Zone and the Lekki Deep Sea Port. The Dangote Refinery is a 19 billion dollars project that will be the largest in africa and one of the largest in the world imagine the scale of work and imagine the kind of infrastructure needed to support this wonderful project here's what you might not know this road construction is indeed a complex engineering pattern from the drainage system to the road grading and applying the asphalt thick enough to withstand the weight of thousands of trucks like i said earlier this is a concrete road. The project is about sustainability, ensuring that the road won't degrade under every use. This road is not just about getting from point A to point B. It's about connecting Nigeria to the future. Soon, this place will be buzzing with industrial activity like never before. 
Also, this has necessitated the opening of many estates in this location. Estate like MN Estate Phase 1 that is currently selling for 60 million naira per plot is also located on this Eleko junction down to the Dangote refinery. The estate is about 7 to 10 minutes drive to the Dangote refinery. So with the presence of MN Estate in Eleko axis, that means expatriates and Nigerians who are looking for a residential estate that is not too far to the Lekki Free Trade Zone, Lekki Deep Sea Port, and the Dangote Refinery will definitely pick MN Estate Phase 1 as their place of residence. And this will in turn turn real estate in this location into a very lucrative business itself. And not just real estate alone, some businesses have commenced operation malls like these and hospitals are also being constructed and in operation to meet the needs of the growing population of these Ibejileki Isaacs. You know, this journey reminds me of life itself. Sometimes, the road we travel isn't always smooth, it's full of bombs, portals, and traffic. But with the right effort and patience, things begin to change. The same way these roads have been expanded is how we should approach our lives. It's about creating room for growth and navigating through challenges until we get into our destination. So what's the takeaway from this journey? It's not just the construction we have witnessed, it is the transformation. This world is a symbol of what we can achieve when we are committed to progress. Whether it's in our economy, in our communities, or in our personal lives. The lesson here is simple. Keep building, keep expanding, and never stop moving forward. Thanks for joining me on this road trip. Don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe, and drop a comment below. Let's keep the conversation going. What other areas in Lagos, Nigeria, do you think need this kind of transformation?